Welcome to the FuseNet How-To Series. This video will provide a walkthrough of the information available in the FuseNet Data Explorer Knowledge Base. I'm Zoe Wingate, the FuseNet Documentation Specialist. In this video, you'll learn to access the Knowledge Base from within the FuseNet Data Explorer and to navigate and search the Knowledge Base. There are a few ways we can access the Knowledge Base from within the Data Explorer. On the home page, we have the Knowledge Base Articles section. And here you can see a small selection of articles with links into the Knowledge Base. You can also use the Support button located in the bottom right hand corner. Here you can search for articles and even read them from directly within the Data Explorer. Finally, we have the profile icon located in the upper right hand corner. And here we can access a link to the knowledge base as well. Now I've opened the Data Explorer knowledge base, which can be accessed directly at any time at help.fuse.net slash FDE. Let's take a look at a couple tips for navigating through the knowledge base. Our main navigation is located on the left hand side and can be used to browse and navigate through the different pages. You can also move around within a page by using the right-hand side navigation. The search bar at the top can also help you to look up relevant content. Here, first and foremost, we have the Getting Started Guide. This guide brings together information from across the knowledge base that is most relevant to new users. This includes an overview of what the Data Explorer offers, how to navigate the application, an overview of the different data domains, and tips for searching, filtering, customizing, and visualizing data. Under About the Data Explorer, you'll see information on the navigation using the home page as well as the user profile page. Then we can take a little bit closer look at choosing a data domain. So we have this overview page here, as well as all of the individual domain pages. So this will give you more information about exactly how you can filter the data, as well as the options for data visualization and export. You can also find some additional information on using the domain pages. So this includes, for example, some additional information on using search operators, as well as how to use the filters efficiently. And there's also the information available about creating and saving data sets and visualizing and exporting data. The About Our Data section is new to the knowledge base, and here you're going to find more about the context of the data and the data collection methodologies, and this is all broken out by country. So this is our initial set of data books that are available, and this will continue to grow and expand. So we can see that we have some summary information here and the food security context information. And then here we have some specifics about crop data, such as the data sources, reporting units, the year and season definition, and continuing on to the production system codes and the methodology. There's also this section of additional resources, which includes linking information to the FuseNet API, definitions and standards, which includes abbreviations and acronyms, the glossary and metadata standards. There's also frequently asked questions. And then finally, we have the recent update section, which contains a full archive of all uh, the details of the changes that have been made to the Data Explorer. So you can go through and browse through that at any time. Thanks for watching. Remember to visit the Data Explorer knowledge base at help.fuse.net/fde, and you can subscribe to our YouTube channel for more how-tos.